Okay guys, so it looks like the gauges are working now. Uh, I'm not sure how I got it to work. So that's good, so that's working. Oil pressure's good. RPM are good, fuel pressure is good, coolant temperature, both fans are on. It's kind of holding around 200, so that's okay because we're not even moving. And I did bleed the uh, rack by turning the wheel lock to lock because it. Uh, I put a new, uh, well, it's the LS steering pump on the Mustang rack, right? So, uh, so yeah, so there it is. Fuel gauge is good. All the lights are green down here, so that's good. Oil pressure is good, RPMs are good, fuel pressure 43. I got a, I got a uh, boost uh, compensating regulator on here, but we're not going to see any uh, fuel pressure increase because there's no load on this thing because I'm just in neutral right now. So uh, we won't see the fuel pressure go up with boost. And there's a boost gauge right there, you see that? So this is just a tablet, a Windows tablet I'm using here just to monitor everything. So we'll use that in conjunction with this. And we got, uh, that looks like everything's working pretty good, guys. So I'll take you outside right now, show you that. I'm not sure how I got this working, but it wasn't working, but now it is. So I must have pressed something on here. So anyways, I'll read up on it. So I'll go outside the car now and show you. Right there. That's the LS uh, power steering pump we converted with a valve in there. We work with our Mustang rack. On 376.75 turbo, working good. Custom piping, air fuel ratio right there. We're running the factory uh, intake truck. 1,000 cc injectors, work really good. So yeah, looks like she works pretty good, guys. I'm gonna shut it down. now temperature so that's still okay we got fuel gauge work that works good gauges again air fuel is working boost is moving a little bit when I give it gas so that's good and it didn't stall out so that's awesome Again, all, all the lights are green down here. I'm going to show you quickly what I got going on, how I'm running my, my car in the garage here with the exhaust. So, we'll just uh, go over here, bear with me. Single door. So, I'll show you what's going on here. Guys, that's what it, that's what it'll sound like. See how quiet it is in the garage there. So that's what it sounds like. So it's not. It's got a pretty good exhaust note actually. So that's nice. See how quiet it is here with the tube. So I just made. I just bought this from Amazon here. So that's how we can tune our car and get it to temperature. So that's what it would sound like if the exhaust was open. That sounds pretty good. Yeah, gauges are still working, so that's good. So we got the gauges working. Everything's working, temperature's holding at 200. Fans are on, both of them. Well, it's just one fan, but I got to wire to one one relay. I might have to wire it to two because then I can get low speed and high speed. 
But anyways, guys, yeah, first start up. Just wanted to test everything. Everything seems to be working, so that's awesome. So a trip project turbo LS. Uh, yeah, so the quick start up here, little five minute video, just to show how everything was working. It's been a long project, about two years. So uh, I'll try to post this tonight. We'll see how it goes. But anyways, here's my Terminator X Max, just mounted in here. So that's pretty cool. All right, guys, I'll try to post this video. Just using a Windows tablet again for my gauges. Good enough for now. And I'll post this video and then, of course, make some more. Thanks for watching, guys.